Hello everybody, how is it going? Welcome to another episode of, what are we playing here? Mountain Blade 2 Bannerlord. Guys, I want to go back to Ox Hall because, um, actually, can we disband that? I don't need that army anymore because we are in times of peace. Um, I want to go to Ox Hall because, uh, first of all, this is in, in my own territory. And secondly, uh, yeah, we don't get involved. They got the looters already. Um, secondly... They are giving us a good price for the wares that we are carrying around, and um, I wanna I wanna get things done there. Also, I'm still in the process of trying to get the first mission done, like uh, finding out about uh, Nerez's folly. This is not going well so far. I need to talk to more lords, and for that I probably have to roam around a bit and um, you know see if I can find some lords who are actually willing to talk to me. Uh, lords from different factions, though. So let's go ahead and um, first of all. Devon District. Who are you? Who are you? Uh, no. Uh, no. Okay, there, there are no companions that I really want to keep or, or take. Uh, also, nothing in the arena. So, let's take a look at the trading. Because I want to trade with my with my friends here. Um, there's nothing really that we can get rid of here. But when we take a look at this here, there should be a good price for steel. Right? No? Iron ore? Oh, that's 109? Both of it is quite valuable, I believe. It says... Wait, it's red here. Why is it red? Uh, this item is more expensive than average. Yeah, you know what? I'm gonna drop my iron ore. I'm gonna drop my... I have a lot of iron ore. I'm gonna drop my steel as well. So that you can... That you can build something with it here. Crude iron as well. I'm gonna keep the hardwood. Probably gonna drop the clay as well. Alright, that seems good. Uh, and we have a sheep. We can slaughter that sheep. Can we not? Oh, I thought we could. Okay, we're gonna sell it then. And all of a sudden we get 6,000 dinars. But we don't stop here because there's also one thing that I want to quickly check. Is there anything in terms of body armor that I can afford that will give me a bit more protection? That is it. I want it. How do I get it? It's 30 body armor. That's beautiful. 11,000 dinars though. Ah oh, man, I will come back. And I will get it, because that's such a major upgrade for us. Um, we're gonna get that. And I also want to recruit some more troops here, because we have we have a quite high limit right now. And uh, I want to start training them. There we go. And what we also need to take care of is we need to get some more horses. So, 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 so. Let me think about that. Uh, how do we get money? Uh, we could get money by looting looters. Or we could get money by destroying that hideout here. I think we're gonna go to the hideout. And as soon... Yeah, that's 14 forest bandits. We can, de can deal with that. 100%. Mm, that'll give us a bit of uh, equipment. That'll give us, hopefully, a bunch of prisoners. But they only have peasants. Okay, never mind. And, uh, of course, also the, the loot in general. First of all, we're gonna do the following. Shields up. So we have a shield wall. And I want my people to follow me. And now we're gonna shoot this guy's head off. Maybe not. 27 damage delivered. Okay. Oh god. That's a bushwhacker. They actually hit us. Man, shields up everybody. What I'm talking about. Got him. I was a freebooter. Okay. So the good news is that he just uh, dropped his arrows. And I'm gonna take these arrows in order to in order to keep going here. Yeah, fill my arrows up. Thank you. Good. Let's keep going, guys. It's important that we are sneaky. There's a guy in the back. That was a bad shot. He is standing still as a result. Got him. Alright, he's aware now. Come on, forest bandit. 27 damage. I don't want to lose uh, an eye of, like like anybody here. 73, not bad at all. I think if we keep doing what we are doing here, I think we get it done. Okay, guys, attack. Let's go. I'm actually f quite happy with my accuracy so far. Ow, that hurt, but it's okay. Good, 44 damage. 
And we almost got it. Okay, guys, stay with me again. Stay with me, stay with me. Good. Um, we need more arrows. Let's fill it up here. We are up to 27 again. Actually, no, wait, there's only one enemy alive and he is down there. Let's try to hit him from afar. Where did he go? There he, there he is, alright. 42. Oh my god, this bow is so much better than what we had before. And that was good. So we're gonna swap over to our lands because now the bandit captain is coming. The bandit lord, the bandit... I don't know, sergeant, the bandit... The bandit dude with the fancy hat. Cool, and we will definitely not fight a duel with you, dude. Nice, attack! Wait! One of our guys got killed! Why? Because... Because they just were standing there and then these archers, they were just going for it. Oh crap. Oh crap. Alright, we just lost the volunteer, that's the good news. And we get plus one athletics and plus three archery. And that for just playing a mountain bandit camp here. Uh, I'll take the prisoners, why not? And I will also take, let's see... Yeah, this ranger bow is pretty bad. Mm, this will give us a bit of money here, as I was saying. So that's the good news. And we're gonna take that. So what was that? 11,000? 11,000 dinars to get the, the fancy um, armor there? Hmm. We definitely have to fight the looters here. Alright, let's get that done. Surrender or die, brigand! Because I want fancy, shiny clothes. Let's do it. And since we have a good chunk of cavalry, I just sent them in right now. Yeah, look at that. Stop shooting! Take them down! Hello? Charge? Attack. Yeah, here we go. Alright. Let's go. We are still pretty bad with horse archery in full run. I mean, wow, that actually hit. Okay. Yup, that's a headshot. That's damage to my horse body. And as long as we are as long as we are shooting, we are fine. Good. Here comes the infantry. Look at that. All the people. Oh yeah. Get him, boys! He's dead. Okay. Ah, very close. And this is how we win. Very well fought, people. I'm very proud of you. And that gives us also renown and everything. And uh, I will I will try to just get enough money so that we can get to 11,000. Currently, we have a positive of income. Not the most, but it's okay. Uh, so let's get back here. I mean, another thing that we can do is we can just stay here a while and do a little bit of smithing. What about that? We have 100 stamina. We should definitely do that. So let's go ahead and get some charcoal. And then we're gonna smelt on the wooden hammer. And then we're gonna get some more charcoal. And we're gonna get this down. And we're gonna build some more charcoal. And that. Okay. And I think we need more hardwood. Yes, we need more hardwood. We only have one item here. And then uh, the thing that I want to do is I want to just get the iron and, and sell it again so that we can get some more, um, you know, some more just money. Cool. So, that being said, here's hardwood. How much is it? 22. All right. I'm gonna, you know what, I'm gonna take a bunch of this now. All right. Because I will probably smith a lot over the course of this. We might as well do it like like this. Melt it down. And now we don't have enough stamina anymore. No, 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 no. Not possible. Not possible, but it's okay. Cool. So, with that, we have a bunch of iron bars, and these iron bars they will they will trade very well here as we uh, as we you know seen before. Okay. Iron, wrought iron, crude iron. All of that dates is 90 what? I will sell the dates here. Okay, it's only 500 gold, as well as, of course, the bow, the armor, and the rusty falchion. Seems good. Still, nothing in the arena so far. Do I trade now? I don't know. I don't know if I should do it already. Can't afford it. And I want it. And it looks so beautiful. And then we're gonna put that body armor on you. Mm, okay, this is the same. This is also the same. Alright! You know what? 
We will pay 10,600 and we still have one solid K. That's a major upgrade for us. That's gonna be so good in the long term. Now, I want to go ahead and I want to get more archers. I want to um, I want to build up an army yet again. I mean, that's, that's what we are doing all the time here. Uh, and that army should consist of way more ranged unit than we had before. I want to be able to shoot down the enemies, especially in open field battles, like crazy. 29 looters there. We will get them. We will get them after we got the 18 here. Because that's, that's going to be a great training opportunity for all of my troops. So, we'll attack. I'll send everybody to charge directly. And then we do something like this. Right, come on. Random shots while we are moving. If you can actually connect those at long range, then um, it's pretty good for your for your learning process. Because the more difficult the shot, the more uh, proficiency you will get. And difficulty is determined by your own speed, the speed of the enemy, and um, of course, the distance between you and your enemies. Please not move around that much. Please hold still. I'm trying to get some experience. Oh, come on, really? No. Okay. This is weird. That was so weird. Ha! <laughs> First try. See that? Uh, Alright, Trenton gets plus one archery. Love to see that. Uh, no prisoners here. We're gonna take all of the loot so that we can smith it again. And then there was like 29 looters up here. And I want to get them. And after that, um, we're gonna dive a little bit into like the central continent because I want to hire some more imperial recruits and train them into archers later. So, here we go. And of course, I want to go for the, the main quest. Charge! Everybody! Up! Charge in! Alright, here we go. That hit. So, engaging from a flank like this is pretty good because you can actually align the shots a little bit higher so that it definitely hits something. You know? Just lining them that, that up in a, in a nice line and you engage from the side, which gives you a very good angle. Good. And I really hope that we don't lose anybody here. Let me see. Yeah, no, they are running already. Look at that. It's so mean. That is so damn mean. Slaughtering the poor looters. I shouldn't be pitiful though, right? I mean, they chose to thug life. Come on. Die. Yep. And once more. There we go. Got him. Got most of them. Yeah, but you know what? I will, I will farm them a little bit. If I can. No, I can't. Okay, fine. Uh, we get plus one archery. Uh, sorry, plus one polar and plus one riding. As long as we are upgrading our, our own skills here, I'm super happy. Um, speaking of upgrading, mm, the battalions need to be upgraded. The Imperial archers are now trained archers. We have a gallant that is now at a knight. We have oh, infantrymen. Mm. Ah, let's get some shields here. I like the shields a lot. Okay. And a good chunk of crap, because they are looters. So, I would say we're gonna start our journey into the into the center of all of this here. Um, let's go up here. And see if we can get some of these, um, yeah, some of these archers. And of course, we need to see the nobles and talk to them. Obviously. Oh, there's a big host, did you see that? Oh wait, another hideout. It's a lot of bandits. And a lot of bandits could give me a lot of good loot. I wanna check this. So, first of all, we're gonna take these mountain bandits, right? Yeah. Okay. Surrender or die, Brigand. That's the first thing. And then we're gonna probably go for the hideout in order to, to get some more stuff. Come on, boy. Oh, God. Alright. And uh, we are fighting in a village. I hate that, especially being on horse in this area. Here we go. <coughs> Ow, that must have hurt. Oh, this actually hurts myself. That's pretty bad. I don't want to get hurt so much because there is a big fight coming in a in a hideout and I need to be unharmed for it. Mm -mm, mm -mm. I'm disengaging. I'm gonna run away. <laughs> Here comes the infantry. And up. And now we go in. No, we don't. 
they're dead. <laughs> all right, all right, all right. My men are good enough for that. No upgrades for us, but we will get probably a little bit of a better loot here since these guys were hillmen. And yeah, they have beer. I mean, beer is always good, never bad. So we'll wait, and I will. I will just try it. Worst case scenario is we're gonna drag out by our friends and. Uh, we have to do it once more. Okay, guys, shields up. Wait. Shield wall, okay, so we got that. And I want you to follow me. That's a pretty good shield wall, I like it. And that's an instant kill. Headshot. He's having javelins there. Um, help me, friends. Uh, actually, charge him. Charge him! And now follow me. Well fought, people. Well fought. Uh, so, where's the rest of them? Seems like they have pretty low tier, um, uh, units here. Hmm. That means that I should be able to kill them all quite quickly. Since I also seem to have pretty good of my, uh, like, pretty good units myself. But let's not get too cocky. Let's try to soften them up. Okay, guys. I want you to move here. Okay. Build a nice shield wall. Thank you. Good. Good. He's just throwing stones there. Seems to be a looter. Or a hillman, yeah. Good. Oh, uh, oh, he has a shield, but he is dead now. This is working. This whole shield wall arrow thing is actually quite good. Now, the biggest problem that I'm having right now is that I'm low on ammo. Yeah, he only has wait, recurve bow. Swap with heavy recurve. Oh no, wait, my my recurve bow. Yeah, never mind. Uh, they are only having something like like javelins and and so on. Okay, okay, okay. Where's the next camp? I need you to build my shield wall again, guys. Right here. Now I will try to attract the enemies. Okay. Down he goes. Follow me. <laughs> this is actually quite good. So, even when, um, let's say outnumbered, then you can actually get something done here. The problem is that I'm really running out of ammo. The man down. Okay, bit of damage, and that's my kind of last arrow here. Attack! Let's go! Down he goes! All right, here we go. Nice. So, one more camp. Attack. Just go in, guys. I think this is it. This is where we where we just win now. Oh yeah, uh, I should really raise my shield because these javelins are quite nasty. Get him, boys! Yeah, you can deal damage. Okay. There are two more people on the left. Good. Uh, so I want to track this guy. Hey, dude, stop it. Never mind. Okay. 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 Nobody died. And down goes the hillman. Cool. So, Mr. Forest Bandit Chief. Yeah, he's swaggering about here. I'm gonna, I'm gonna kill you. I have enough men, and I have enough guts. Charge, man! Charge, charge, charge! I need your help! Okay, okay, we got this. Just poke him! Poke him good, poke him hard! And that's what she said. Perfect! Flawless! And we even trained athletics, which I'm actually quite happy about. Athletics plus two. And we get two points of archery, even. Very nice, very, very nice. I'll take the prisoners, sure, why not? Let's take him with us.
Worst case scenario is we're gonna drop these people again, and um, there's no harm done. Cool. Cool, cool, cool. 38 looters. I mean, we have to, right? Stop. No, 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 stop. Ugh, God. Yeah, we are not helping. Are we? Ah. I want. I don't want to bother with it. No, instead, I want to go here to Lagata. Let's take the shortest route. And honestly, we could actually go to our castle. We have a castle. We can just dump some recruits there. And, um, you know, strengthen the garrison a bit. I like that we have positive income here, by the way. This is super good. And then there are more forest bandits. Uh, which we try to kill. Sure. Stay here, bandits. This hideout is too much for us. I don't want to do that. So, another fight, another bit of experience for our people, and we're just gonna crush them with our cavalry. Give them hell. That's how we do it. I will probably try to get in there and, uh, you know, distract them a bit for the troops. Where are they? There we go. Uh, and then, ah, got these little trees. Ah, yeah, the problem is that they have bows and they know how to use them. Wait, what? See, this is what I mean. But it's okay. I can heal. And my people, they will probably die, so I don't want that. Yeah, we got him. And that's it. Alright. Victory is ours. This is crazy that we still get upgrades, although we are not really doing that much. Uh, with, with that amount of progression, I do believe that we will get a level quite quickly. So, we'll take that. Let me check that out real quick. 49 out of 75. Uh, we can actually get another polearm skill here. 70% more damage to horses or plus 2 damage. Uh, no, plus 2% combat movement speed while wielding a polearm. No, I'll take the horse killer. That's gonna be good. Cool. So, up to Lagada. I want to see if there's anybody here that is notable that... You hear Ratagos Kolbiter, whom you got separated after a battle, has been sighted in the settlement. Oh. Wait. Am I not having my full... Oh! I'm missing a companion! Hey, dude. Can you can you join me again? Ratagos! What's going on, man? What's happening? Where did you go? I don't know. But it's good to have you back. All right, all right, all right, all right. No, that's super interesting. Um, we're gonna ransom some prisoners here. Sure, why not? It's a bit of money. And I want to see if there's something like a tournament. There's nothing. Can we smith? Ah, 28. It's not, it's not big. Not big at all. Oh, uh, let's smelt... Uh, spike mace. And let's smelt a hammer. And that is it for the moment again. But hey, we're slowly but surely getting things done. So, I want to trade my stuff in that I just got from all of the looters here. So let's get rid of that. I don't even care about what they had. There's nothing valuable in there anyway. But we get 3,600, speaking of value, right? Um, recruit troops? Uh, these are Imperial recruits. Yeah, I'll take them. I'll absolutely take them. Also... One thing. My party size was 113 without the coal biter dude. Now it's down to 96, so they take additional slots here. Very much seems like it. Um, so this is gonna be a wood runner. This is gonna be a trained archer. This is gonna be yeah, whatever mercenary guard. Cool. So that being said, let's go ahead and actually go to our own castle. Before that. Let's take a look around the keep. There's nobody here that can really tell me anything about my main quest, but... I mean, it was worth a check. Let's keep going, let's keep moving. And I do believe that eventually I want to get another caravan, because they are actually making quite good money. Good all. And then we just probably dump the good stuff here at our castle, so it's well protected. Also, it makes sense taking a look at that, because we might want to issue another another upgrade or two. Let's see how far our prosperity goes. 
Hello, I'm home. Is dinner ready? Let's go, manage castle. Um, there's still stuff going on. Um, here's the thing. I'm gonna dump a bit more money into this. And then what? Gardens? Definitely. Workshops? Definitely. Granary? Definitely. Militia barracks? Definitely. Okay. We are actually making positive food here. Our prosperity is growing slowly. But it is growing at the very least. Alright. Alright, alright, alright. So this is kind of okay. Talking about okay. We have a pretty good garrison here. Just the best of the best from my last visit. Which means... I will probably dump even more into this here. Yep. Absolutely. Just the best footmen. The best archers that I have. Um, I will probably keep my, my cavalry though. Let me go ahead. Put that on top. This guy. This guy. All of these guys. Come on. Everything that is tier 4 or higher can just stay here. And I'm just training the others. There we go. There we go. God, I have more, so much cavalry. It's cold biter. Um, there's another knight. All right, so we have the cavalry on top, and all of the other guys are tier three or less. Cool. Yeah, this looks great. Now, uh, problem is that, of course, the garrison wages are quite high here. Seven hundred and thirty-two to guard the castle. <sighs> And we have, what, 109 people guarding this, as well as um, 68 people of militia. That's okay. I want this cast guarded, big time. Alright. So what can we buy here in our, in, our own, in our own village? What are you producing, by the way? Iron ore. Alright. That's quite expensive, though. Yeah, it's 110. It's very expensive. I will not buy that. What I will do, probably buy some grain from you. Actually, you need food as well. Ah, never mind. I'm gonna get your troops. Cool. And then we're gonna keep going, guys. Let's go to rotate. This is the next big stop here. Actually, let's go here before. Let's uh, see if we can get some cheap cheese and butter. And um, recruit some more troops here, obviously. Alrighty. It's not cheap. It's absolutely not cheap. Mm -mm. We're not gonna do that. Also, there's a hideout. Near my castle. Yeah, but you have a lot of bandits, so I'm not going in there. Uh-oh. Uh-oh, not gonna do that. Uh, Batanians have made peace. Okay, but why are we building armies? We're not at war with anybody. Alright, so. Next big thing. It's gonna be a tournament, and I really hope that we're gonna win this. This is okay body armor. I was like, why did I buy body armor when I can get something here? But no, this is just okay. It's not great. We will probably give it to a friend. Uh. Oh, why would you move when I shoot? Okay, there's a shield. I will uh, try to get it. Yeah, I imagine something like that. Good shot. Goodbye. Okay, we won. It's fine. We're gonna bet on ourselves again. And go in. Yeah, I think doubling up on these guys is a good idea. Get him. Come on, blue dude. Blue dude, hit. Please, thank you. Good. Now we're gonna go for the yellow dudes and the red dudes. <laughs> uh, especially for the yellow dudes because they are outnumbering everybody else currently. So yeah, we got this. Oh wait, we might not get this because this guy is pretty sturdy. Right. Um, another bet. I'm playing one versus one now. But yeah, we are playing sword and shield. That's gonna be okay. What? I mean, I have better armor than he has. I'm taking very minimal damage here. Oh, 
All right, skip round. Last round here. I want to get all the money in the world. As well as, of course, the renown. The three renown for a fight like that. Pretty good. Of course, there's more glory to be won on bigger battles. But for the moment, it's better than looters. And we are not at war with anybody, so... What? Stop it. So I might just go for some tournaments in the time of peace. It's like what the knights did anyway. Wow, this guy is taking the damage to the chest without a problem. Yeah, I need to go for his head. There we go. Nice fight. So, another tournament won. We got a woven leather coat as well as 900 dinars from our bets. And three renown. Cool. So, I probably want to give this thing to one of my party members. Let's go to my inventory, see who can actually make use of that thing. It is more body armor. Less leg armor, but also more arm armor. Alright, have it. Looks good. Wow, I like the looks of that. That looks savage. It's cool. Um, alright. So, more recruits please, thank you very much. Alright, let's go and continue our search for more lords. Nobody in the keep, obviously. Hmm. Alright, Jamaris. Just roam around the country, looking for fights. Yes, that was a quote. Mountain bandits, I don't care. The 28 looters might be a good fight for us. So we'll take these guys. Mm. We enter the smithy? No. So I don't... Oh, wait, I do believe that you will get some smithing um, stamina back whenever you are resting somewhere. But yeah, these guys cannot go anywhere. Surrender or die, I have some troops to train, man. Let's go. Okay, how many archers do we have? None. That's all infantry, okay. Everyone attack, these are looters. Let's go, boys. Let's do it. And here they come. Let's lower the lance. 700 damage. Alright, that's so massive. And here comes the cavalry. <laughs> oh, that's actually a mass of looters, though. And the mass of looters can actually hurt us quite a lot. Over time. If we're not careful, if they swamp our cavalry. Or with their bodies. Then uh, they might still do something. Ah. Bad shot. Oh, that was the horse. X. Sorry. Sorry, horse. Alright. At this point, the enemies are running. And we got it. But, there are still some enemies that I want to kill. This guy. And then... This guy. Alright. More pole arm skill. Because massive damage. Whenever we do couch damage, it's so massive. Cool. Good fight. So, we are not taking any prisoners as per usual, and uh, we're just gonna take that. Good. And then back to Jalmaris, because... Because, because... What did I want to do in Jalmaris here? Going to the keep? Hi. Can you tell me anything? About this? I wasn't there. Yeah, I figured. I have to talk to the higher lords. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. These guys have horses, and I have a good chunk of money. Let's combine that. I want to get more horses, because my my army is not fast enough. It's never fast enough. Okay. Uh, byproduct, obviously. Sturgeon Hunter. Nice war horse. Requires riding 60, which I have. I want it. Fine. Okay. I got a new horse. Uh, this guy has just more hit points and more charge damage, but it has less speed and less maneuverability. So, yeah. That was a good upgrade. It's amazing. Um, yeah, all of my horses are worse. Uh, I want to get some, like, saddle horses here. Let's just buy it out. I'll take all of your horses. Um, I don't necessarily need another mule, do I? I mean, we have a bunch of pack camels and so on. No, it's fine. 3,900. And we have 1,400. 1,400 used. Whatever. They are cheap. I'm gonna take them. Cool. Very, very good. So, the next big thing. 
uh, is uh, hitting looters in the face. But while we are going to the next city, we're gonna go ahead and hit some looters. That's what we do. Surrender or die, yet again. I wish there was a there was another war because I'm I'm really really looking forward to more sieges. And I mean, we have some very good troops in our garrison, and we can also use them as attack squads. Okay, get some of this done here. Ow! Ow! And that hurt. This horse is pretty cool. I can really feel the maneuverability coming in. I don't know if you can see it, because I'm kind of stumbling around the battlefield right now. But it, the feel, the acceleration, um, the momentum you can build up so quickly, it is really good. Okay. Hi. Goodbye. So, another looter down, and we made the country a little bit safer today. <laughs> Let's get out of here. Hmm, nice upgrades. I like it. Not on me, but on my companions. That's good. Okay. So. Uh, yeah, again, the next big thing is obviously going to Zenokia. No, wait. Yeah, Zeonica. That's it. That's what it's called. Vlandia has declared war on Sturgia. Okay, I was asking for it. Ask and you'll receive. I'll take the recruit here. Uh, I'll join the tournament as well, of course. Of course, of course, of course. Maybe there's something that we can get. And yeah, it's cool, simple leather armor. Yep, I want that for my companions. Let's join this. Ooh, I have a lance. All right, all right. I'm not able to do any damage with it, but I have a lance. Mm, this lance is not that great. Uh, let's go for the... Nah, let's go for the riders first. Stop hitting my friends! You're not allowed to do that. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. I cannot couch this land. Oh, I can couch the land! Okay, in that case... I have the horse killer ability, right? I should be able to deal quite a good damage to horses with my pole arm. Yeah, that's a problem. Mm-hmm. So far. So bad. I'll take the shield, thank you. Uh, can I take your sword as well? Thank you. Alrighty. Mm. It might be better. Okay, so now we got this guy. Uh-oh. I wanted to say it might have been better to go for the horse with the lance. By the way, we're gonna keep him in stun lock here. He only has a very slow weapon, and I could just do it like that. No horses on the field. Oh, wait, there's one horse all the way in the back. Okay, I'm the last guy. Horse, 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 horse. Thank you. Okay, I'm out of here. <laughs> All right, all right, all right, all right. Uh, it's one versus one versus one. I want to win this tournament, honestly. Yeah, this is risky. He also brings a good amount of momentum. Yeah. All right, now we got it. Okay, I'm behind him. Couch the lance. Ah, oh, that didn't work. On damage delivered, that was nothing. Uh oh. I'm scared. That's my horse. Shield up! No! It wasn't fast enough. It wasn't fast enough. Yeah, we're gonna skip the match. And I didn't qualify for the next round. Good job. It's fair. Fair fight. I gotta accept that. So, the other thing that we can try to do is smith. We have only 8 stamina, so it doesn't matter. And going to the keep. Oh, look at that! Boom. That is what I wanted to achieve. Hi, I'm Trenton. Can you please te uh, tell me about that? Oh no, you have. Oh, you only have a quest for me. Hmm. So what is it? You have the reputation of being able to manage ruffians. Maybe you can take them off my hands. And find some other lord who has more need for them. More dinars. Oh, oh yeah, sure. You have some mercenaries. I'm gonna take them, and sell them to somebody else. 
That's good. Hey, dude. Hi. My name is Trenton. You want mercenaries? It's a good prize. How tough are they? Um, they're good. Bandits can kill as well as any other kind of troops. And then we're gonna go with this down here. Oh, that's ineffective. Ah, no, no, no. <laughs> Alright, critical success. That is what we needed. Ooh, otherwise we would have uh, these, these black bad mercenaries in our company. And they would steal from us all the time. Alright, relation increased. That's good money as well. Okay. I'm happy. Wait. Company of trouble. And you have another mercenary squad? Wait a second. What do you want from me? Yeah, 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 yeah. This is the same quest. And you know what we're gonna be doing now? We're gonna sell the mercenaries to her. Let's do it. Hi. I heard you need mercenaries. How tough are they? Oh, yeah, they're really tough. Oh, they are so tough. That you can, you can do whatever you want with them. And it's a success. <laughs> They just swapped their troops. This is why I wanted to have a high charm skill, guys. That was the easiest money ever. As in ever. We got 15k out of nowhere. That is so good. <laughs> um, You know what we're going to be doing now? Uh, we're going to build a workshop here. These guys are producing grapes. These guys are producing grain. These guys are also producing grain. So... I want to build a workshop here so that we have more passive income. Uh, I'm gonna go to... Enter the arena. Get out of here instantly because that's uh, probably the fastest way to the center of the city. And then we're gonna take a workshop here. So double grain around. That's good. What can we do with that? It's a wine press which makes a lot of sense. Back street, waterfront, arena. Okay, let's check this out. Silversmith. Do we have a silver mine here? Uh, you know what? I'm gonna buy the wine press. I mean, we can keep the wine press even. Uh, who's working here? No, this is Iron Skull. Okay, this is a criminal. Oh, wait, we might be at the brink of day. Nobody is working yet. Seems like it. Yep, there's nobody here. Nobody that I can talk to. Just a bunch of people. Is Ziga true or the Wanderer? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, so we have to get out of here again. Uh, let me quickly leave the city. Let's take a look at the time. Wait, no, it's like in the middle of the... Middle of the thing. Day, it's called. Huh. Take a walk around the town center again. Uh, we will now start outside of the center. No, oh, wait. Okay, here's the silversmith. That's the good news. Why are there no workers outside? N nobody's working here. Hello? Hi, who are you? That's a criminal. Um. No shop workers. Nobody. Not a single person here. Or can I not... Can I not open a workshop in a... In a city that I'm not... An alliance with? Maybe. Maybe that's the case. Alright. Um, I'm gonna let some time pass here. And I'm going back. And I wanna try this again, okay? So let's take a look around. Maybe it was just a bug. I don't know. I cannot tell. Hello, my friends! How are you doing today? I'm just an innocent person trying to take a look around in your city. I have no bad intentions. In fact, I want to invest in, in your in your beautiful businesses here. So. No, nobody's working here. Which means I cannot buy this. That's a shame. Okay, let's get out of here, guys. So we leave. No. In that case, we're going to invest. We're going to reinvest our money that we just got. Into the most valuable items that you can provide. Step Warbo. This thing is good. That's really good. Holy crap, I want that thing. How do we get it? 
Okay, um, the answer is easy, I think. Uh, we sell this. All of it. Sell this. We're gonna keep our ponies and everything. Mm, that's important. But do we sell our own bow? I don't want to. I really don't want to. I'd rather give my bow to another companion then, my old one. 17,000. No, no I can't. I just can't. I'm gonna completely cripple my own economy. See, we are kind of on the on the edge of uh, profit here. And since we are also upgrading some of my some of my troops here. Oh, we don't we don't have any war horses. Yeah, see? Uh, we cannot upgrade any of these guys anymore. Okay. Um sturdy and shul the soldiers. Yeah, sure, fine. Upgrade them like this. Landing recruits, sure. Imperial recruits are always gonna be archers now. Okay. Let's seek some trouble. Let's go to the next... Oh, actually, this hideout is gonna be super easy. And the people will be super, super happy that we deal with them. See, they only have like six mountain bandits. Okay. Here we go. Oh, this is so... Oh my god, that's so beautiful. We instantly fight the, the, uh, the sheep guy. <laughs> love it. I love it. Good day to you, sir. You have nothing that you can throw against me. We don't fight like that. Okay. Just close distance here. Gonna absorb some damage. And we got it. Easiest fight ever. Absolutely. Absolutely the easiest fight ever. So, uh, and... Ooh, we get a nice 2,497 gold dinars worth of rusty falchion. Hell yeah! I mean, with that we can technically go back. But no, let's go to Poros. I want to check out if I can um, get a workshop here. I mean, why not? Let's check it out, guys. Oh wait, there's a siege going on. I mean, at the very least I can talk to these people. If they survive. Hi! Yeah. I gotta wait for that. They seem to have some trouble. Hmm. And now they are dead. Now I cannot talk to the question mark guy anymore. You bastards. <laughs> Go to the keep. Yeah, nobody's here. Ransom the prisoners. Join the tournament, because that's what we are here for. Um... Yeah, seems okay. Ah. Drawing weapons. Okay. Mm-hmm. Okay, let's go for the archer. Oh, I can take his bow. I'm very much proficient with the bow here. I'll take it. At the very least, I'll try. Ah, 43. 49. Dodge it. Got him. Okay. Take the bow. Quickly. Good. That's way better. Uh, horse. Good. Now, since the enemies have horses and I don't, that's a bit awkward. But this bow is pretty good. Headshot. Headshot. Yeah, this looks good. We have two enemies on the blue side. We have four of them on our side still. Seems very good. Get him, boy! Man, I don't want to hit my friend. Ah, oh, we got him, though. So, um, skip rounds. We're gonna bet on ourselves all the time. This is a 1v1v1. Interesting. V1. Come on. There you go. Alright. Moving, moving, moving. We'll not win this. I will. Oh, maybe not. Huh. Very well done. Ow. Good thing is, thanks to our armor that we just bought, this is so good. We are not really taking damage. That was a miss. And we got him. So, next fight, next bet, next win. Let's go. Uh, Imperial Butchilari. That is a horseback rider, I think. 
So what are you doing with your scale mail here, huh? And your long sword and your and your shield and your fancy helmet. Nothing, I say. Nothing. Let's fight against a Vlandian Banner Knight. Hey, are you on my side? I'm also a Vlandian. Maybe he's even one of my own troops. Oh god. Yeah. So fought. So far. Good. Ah. That's a bad block. That as well. Got him. Nice! Final round of the tournament is mine! We're gonna get some more renown, we're gonna get some gold, as well as the spike kettle over mail. Alright, not bad. Let's go ahead and see how much uh, it is worth, actually. Um, yeah, you know what, we drop that, we drop that, we drop all of... all of this? Yes. My companions have way better stuff than this helmet. Means I can safely sell all, all of this. And, um. Hmm. Mail over strip leather. I mean, it's way better than what I have right now. 46 head armor! It's 246,915. Oh my god. Imperial Lord Helmet. This is probably the best item that I've found so far when it comes to head armor. What about weapons? I'm looking at pole arms. I'm looking especially at pole arms that can cut. Um, yeah, you don't have any. Spear has a quite long reach, but you cannot couch it. I'm not taking it. Okay. We will settle with this and I think I'm happy for the moment. Alright guys, I hope you are happy too. That was another episode of Mountain Blade 2 Bannerlord. And if you did, then don't forget to leave a rating, subscribe to the channel if you haven't already, and I hope to see you guys next time. Goodbye.